So I could not be more excited at the time. I thank everyone in this room who's working in AI, who's working in fusion, who's driving innovation. I thank my friend Ely and, and the fabulous group he runs that's been all in. How do we figure out what are the big scientific issues? How do we mobilize people and motivate action and get smart people that are passionate? You're, you're, a, you're a meaningful driver of this effort as well. Thanks, and I thank you for that. He visited me a few months ago and he said, what can we do? I said, we got to mobilize everyone on fusion. Of course, he, he, he knew plenty about fusion. But I said, we need, we need up-to-date data on what's happening in the U.S., what's happening in China, where this could go, how do we do this kind of efforts. I've asked commercial businesses that same question, and everyone has stood up. You guys released a great report recently. DOE just released one as well. Look, we're going we're gonna to get the fusion ball moving. I think we will see more progress in the next five or ten years, much more progress than in, than in all of the history before on fusion. To everyone sitting in this room, we're finally going to see the reality of fusion come. First in the electricity grid, ultimately in industrial process heat to make things, and hopefully we can rapidly scale that up as we figure out the most efficient topography and technologies to harness fusion. But man, I, again, it is awesome, and I thank you for your help, and I thank everyone in this room for your help in making it happen.